Welcome, and thank you for taking time out of your day to watch video number three of our Pen Setter Parts Awareness Series. I'm extremely excited to bring to you what I think is not only unique, but a revolutionary kit that is going to increase the performance on all of your existing pen setters that have preference systems, and that primarily would be the A2 pen setter. This is going to not only eliminate a tremendous amount of high wear and maintainable items, as you will see in a picture here very shortly, but more importantly, it's going to increase the performance of that system, and it's going to help out with a lot of the problems that some of us are experiencing with the light bowling balls, especially balls that are six pounds and lighter. What you see before me is all that's involved in the kit. We basically got some hardware for mounting, and we've got two very special components that make this kit as wonderful as it is. The first thing that we're going to talk about is your actuator. This is going to replace the spring rod bumper. It's made out of UHMW, ultra high molecular weight polyethylene. It's going to come with a shoulder bolt that's going to go through your existing mounting bracket since there's already a hole provided. And you're going to have a slot on the opposite end that's going to allow that preference rod to go through and you'll see this firsthand in, in the rest of the video coming forward. Another thing that's going to make this very special is this magnet that's included with these two white lines on it. This is a magnet that is only magnetized 180 degrees of itself perfectly. And what we're going to do is we're going to utilize that to replace that bumper on the even lane that the stop latch contacts. And we're going to be able to adjust that perfectly for the top and the bottom cutout of that latch so we can positively guarantee perfect locking and unlocking of that latch when we've got a ball blocked out on the even lane and we're waiting for the odd lane to send that bowling ball across the trip lever. So right now I'd like to take you out. We'll go to the pen setters and show you how this works. Now this preference system conversion kit is split up obviously between both lanes. So we're going to start off on the odd lane and we're going to talk about that actuator that we had mentioned earlier on the video. And that's going to replace that spring rod bumper that would normally go on this front part of your threaded rod, obviously. Now, the nice thing about this actuator is, one, it's made out of UHMW, that ultra-high molecular weight polyethylene. It is, uh, once again, very resistant to abrasion. So we're not going to get that chewing factor that goes on through there as that threaded rod goes back and forth. On the back side of this is where we're actually going to run our existing preference rod. Okay, You're going to utilize the same clamp hardware that you have on the back, and you're going to use the same factory adjustment. Coming over to the even lane, you'll also notice that I've disconnected the lift rods, and that was simply so we could shoot a clean picture for you guys, and you could all get a good visual. But here we have our locking mechanism, obviously, that when two balls are thrown at the same time on a pair, if one goes up the odd lane, as soon as the lift rods are engaged, it's going to lock that latch so that the second ball on the even lane cannot go by until the trip lever on the odd lane has been depressed. Now, by getting rid of this little bushing and bumper that was here and going to that magnet we described earlier on in the video, it's got polarity 180 degrees apart. You can see where we're going to be able to perfectly adjust that so that it's always going to have positive latching and unlatching. And you can see the power of that magnet as that just grabbed that bolt as I got close to it. Now, to really put this in perspective, you know, we're going to show you a final picture of the kit as a whole versus what you're actually eliminating on the OEM version.